there my friends, Eric Andreas, your Guitar Sage here. I'm going to show you today that your hands are not too small to play the guitar. Why is that? Because they're just not. Why do I know this? Because I've been teaching for something like 30 years, more than, and or close to, I should say, close to 30 years. And your hands are not too small. Everybody thinks their hands are too small in the beginning because they're putting their hands around the neck and they don't quite understand how to noodle, how to fret the guitar, okay? And this takes both instruction and time and practice, okay? So not just time, but practice, okay? Now, what happens in the beginning is that when folks approach the guitar, they really want to wrap their hand around the neck like this. And that's very natural because when we pick up a shovel or a broom or something like that, we palm it. We put it right there because that's how we hold on to things so they don't fall out of our hands. We don't hold things like this. If you were going off into battle and you were holding your battle axe like this, it's going to fall out of your hands. You're going to get your head chopped off. So um, we're used to grabbing things like this. This is very, this is in our blood to do this, you know. So it's not very natural for us to do this, okay. So what that means is we have to train ourselves to do that. And everybody from Jimi Hendrix to Eddie Van Halen to myself have had a hard time in the beginning getting used to this. It feels awkward. Everybody feels awkward. Everybody feels like their hand's too small. Unless you have a tiny little doll hand like Kristen Wiig in, on Saturday Night Live, you're going to be able to play the guitar. Why? You will. You just will, okay? So, um... What I want you to do is I want you to, t to get used to taking the, your thumb, putting it on the back of the neck, and that's going to help a lot. You're going to leave a little bit of space between your palm of your hand and the guitar itself. Now, this is going to wear this muscle out a little bit. It's going to be, it's going to be a little bit difficult, but not as difficult to say like running a marathon. So buck up and just do it. It's playing guitar. It should be fun, right? So uh, you'll see more advanced guitar players sometimes hold their, their thumb above the neck and actually... Uh, it's kind of a cruel, uh, a kind of a cruel uh, joke, if you will, that the more you get to playing guitar, the more you'll be able to creep your thumb on, up the top of the neck here and actually hold the guitar like a shovel, uh, where it's nice and comfortable. But in the beginning, you just can't do that because your technique's not good enough. It will get better over time, okay? So your hands are not small enough, I promise. I wouldn't have made this video if I thought your hands were too small. So, you can do this. If you need help with anything, please let me know. I'm here to help. Here on YouTube, you can hit me up on, uh, better yet, on Facebook. That's where you want to hit me up. Facebook, Twitter, uh, Instagram, all those places, I'm there. So, hit me up there. I would love to help you out with any guitar issues that you might have. There's a free ebook at yourguitarsage.com. If you're new to guitar, by gosh, you better get that book because it's going to help you a ton. And check out the unstoppable guitar system you can get in there for one dollar so many great videos for you to check out i want to help you so please let me know how i can help and practice 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 please spay and neuter your animals be kind to one another and don't trust the man practice your guitar see ya